Back at home on a lake or near a beach somewhere sounds nice, I'm sure, but second second home sales rather are down these days. Always Amy Wagner says there are people still buying them though, and it might surprise you to find out who it is. If I told you there's one generation in particular that's buying second homes these days, would you guess it's baby boomers? Well, you'd be wrong. It's Gen Xers. Second home sales have taken a significant tumble in the last couple of years. COVID put everyone in their homes for work, so people started looking for a nice second home. But we're heading back to the offices these days, so sales have dropped substantially. And then there's high mortgage rates. According to Redfin, we're looking at the lowest level of interest in second homes in the last eight years. But that doesn't mean no one is buying. If you assume baby boomers are plunking down their hard-earned money for that second home, you'd be wrong. It's wealthier Gen Xers. On average, second homes cost more than first homes, almost $100,000 more, in fact. Redfin's data points out that 86% of second home mortgages went to affluent, white Gen X buyers, so-called high-income buyers. Because of the high mortgage rates, cash has been king for second home sales right now, and the homes have been purchased to become the primary home eventually. Here's the all worth advice. If you're wondering where most of those second homes are located, the answer, Florida. With your all worth advice, I'm Amy Wagner.